Hi, I'm Sally, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to freeze rows and columns in Microsoft Excel 2016. So I have this, uh, this spreadsheet here with some data in here, and maybe I'm going to add a bunch more data here, but I don't want to lose sight of these uh, headers here because I'm going to want to see what each column is. So there's a really easy way to do this. Uh, if you click over on view and then freeze panes so if I want to freeze just the top row I just click on freeze top row and it stays where it is and it doesn't hide when I scroll uh, if I decide that I want to freeze this uh, first column here all I have to do is click on freeze first column so then as I scroll that column stays put uh, if you want to freeze, maybe you have two header rows, what you do is you highlight the one below it, click on freeze panes, and then click on freeze panes here. So then it holds these first two, uh, these first two rows as you scroll. Now maybe you want to freeze the top row and the left column. So what you'll do is click here at uh, B2 or wherever if you wanted to freeze, you know, the top, you know, uh, if you want to freeze it here, you can freeze it there. But I want to just freeze the top row and left column. So again, go up to freeze panes, click there, and you'll see that not only is it freezing when I scroll up and down, it also holds them there when I scroll left and right and then you can always click here and unfreeze panes. So that's how you do it. I hope this was helpful. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.